the subconscious mind. You know, energy is all that there really is. When you stare at the back of somebody's head, they turn around without you even physically touching them. You know, sometimes you think about somebody and they phone call you, right? I stare at the back of a rearview mirror while I'm driving and the person always turns around. During the space landing, the moon landing, they would communicate the astronauts without even talking to each other through energy. You know, somebody in Toronto, Canada could talk to somebody in Bangkok, China through their energy because energy flows everywhere. All of life vibrates on the frequency of 528 hertz. We now know this scientifically. This vibration, this energy, everything, we are the highest form of life. And we all understand by now, our thoughts are what direct or create the vibration or the emotion that we are in, right? Our thoughts. Now, we have the ability, like no other form of life, we have the gift to think freely, to decide what vibration we're going to be in. Now, the beautiful part is we also have the subconscious mind. The subconscious mind has 50,000 to 100,000 thoughts a day that arise. And now when I say arise, I mean there are tens of millions of more thoughts that are sitting. Now these 50,000 to 100,000 thoughts arise each day depending on what you're doing. If you're working, you're on vacation, you know, you're at the gym working out, whatever it may be. Now get this, this is when things really get interesting. And this is why I, I opened this video off by saying energy is all that there is. Because get this, right, our thoughts that direct this energy Right? Our thoughts, your thoughts, create the physical neural pathways in your brain. Let me repeat that. The, your thoughts create the physical world. Your body is a molecular structure. The, your body, all it really is, all it truthfully is, your body is a molecular structure that vibrates accordingly to the frequency of that you think on. AKA, our subconscious mind is the body. If our thoughts, your thoughts direct your energy, well guess what? Your subconscious mind has 50,000 to 100,000 thoughts arising a day. Now, many people ask, this is where it, this is where it gets really interesting, guys. When you, when you, you have, we have the ability you have the ability to think, to decide what your subconscious mind is going to absorb. Now, this is the rule of creation. Every, all of nature operates on a system, right? There's an operations, a hard coding, I like to use that word, a hard coding, right? The hard coding, the guaranteed programming of how something operates, right? We all know, we all can see Facebook on our phones, but actually understanding the language or the hard coding of Facebook is completely different. The hard coding is exactly how it's going to operate no matter what. Now we have the ability, now we understand the subconscious mind, that it takes 21 days of repetition to build a new algorithm. I like to use the analogy algorithm because the technical term is paradigm. We've all heard the term paradigm. Now a paradigm or algorithm is these habitual patterns and habits that formulate everything that goes on in your life and i just kind of told you why for people that are connecting the dots okay so everything you do from kissing how you breathe when you kiss how you walk how you work how you walk and work how you walk and talk how you talk to people how confident you are how brave you are how courageous you are how honest you are how truthful you are everything your eye color Everything starts from these subconscious algorithms, these paradigms, all of these millions and tens of millions of resting thoughts that have created the neural pathways in your brain and are dictating the vibration your molecular structure, aka your body, vibrates on. I'm just getting started. A scientist by the name of Claude Shannon discovered this, right? This, this very top renowned scientist discovered that in all of the systems and operations of nature, he discovered computer 
encoding in the DNA and structure of life. All of life. Not resembling computer coding, not just like computer coding, but exactly like computer coding. You and I are the highest form of life. All of our computer coding that floats around our molecular structure, our body, is directed by one thing, our subconscious mind. And it takes 21 days, we can freely now think and reprogram our subconscious mind. If I were to ask people, if I were to ask you this, what paradigms, what subconscious algorithms are you running on right now? Do you know how many people, at least I would say, it's safe to say, it's safe to say, at least 75% of the world right now would look at me or look at you and not even know what to say. It's scary. It's, it scares, excuse my language, but the shit out of me. It does. It's, it scares me that much. I don't know how, it, 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 it's not good. It's not safe. It's disgusting that this many people don't even know what they're running on, what what their algorithms or their paradigms are running on. But get this, they don't even know who put those in their mind, their subconscious mind. Now, I want to just throw a little fact at you just to get just to get some thinking going. Really stop and think about this, right? Really think. One family, you can even Google this. This is not that isn't this is not all that hippie conspiracy, you know, random conspiracy theories. This is factual. This is lawfully, lawfully true. You can even Google it. There's one family, one family that owns all of the media and the news. And the same family that endorses all of the major politicians, or most, right, most politicians. They just passed a law, a legal law that prevents YouTube content creators that make children's content, right? The, ch the children's content on YouTube these people can no longer be paid. And I wonder why. Guys, everything, 21 days to build a paradigm. Your subconscious mind, you are either being controlled right now, your subconscious mind by somebody else, and I just told you who, and I don't wanna sit there and point the finger at the problem and get into a dog fight or a cock fight, right, with the problem. I wanna focus on the solution. I wanna give you a solution, a cure, and this is the cure. When when you begin to start thinking, right, for yourself, you discover your true self on the inside. Watch my video on self-love. You have one voice. You have the ability to now think and decide what you're going to program into your subconscious mind. People all over the world are doing it right now. Tens of millions of people with millions more coming in every month are awakening to this power that is our birthright. This is what being created in the creator's highest image means. And unfortunately, only a few have used this up until now. But we have the ability now to think and decide what we're going to do with our subconscious mind. What we're going to program. We have the idea to reject or accept an idea. Why do you think on the nightly news that this one family owns, why do you think for 21 days and onward, do they slam and repetate, right, through repetition, all of these health problems, all of these health issues, over and over again. And you're, people that watch the nightly news, guess what their subconscious mind is? They cannot, they cannot reject it. Right after 21 days, they now have the belief in these health issues and their subconscious mind. Now, we just discussed our body, which is a molecular structure, is then going to embrace and harvest and grow these ideas. And guess who owns all of the dark pharmaceutical companies in the world? How convenient. How convenient. And I could say how convenient over and over again, but we're not going to go into that. I want to focus on the solution. Guys, when you discover your true self, you have the ability to take back your subconscious mind. Everything. We've all heard, right, that the energy that we put out is exactly what we're going to get, right? It's how the universe operates. It's why I told you, energy is all that there is. We already understand that. The physical world is an illusion. Therefore, we understand whatever energy that's going out, just like all of life that's already operating on a frequency and a vibration, is going to come back to you. Now our subconscious mind, your subconscious mind, all of these thoughts, your subconscious mind has the ability to light up an entire planet. Our subconscious minds go out to the universe. 
right? We understand now that the galaxy and the stars, just like the rainbows, vibrate on the frequency of 528 hertz. We now understand this. Therefore, our subconscious minds, which are directing all of this energy, is limitless. It can go out into space. This is the missing piece that we quantum physics understand. I am now starting to study and embrace that this is the missing piece between gravity and space and time. Do not, guys, do not be aware. Become very aware of your thoughts. Be aware of your thoughts and be aware of your thinking all the time. You must begin to start thinking. You must begin to start deciding what you're going to put in your subconscious mind. Because there's nothing. We are curing autoimmune disorder. We have fixed thyroid related issues. Another lady was going to have to have wrist surgery. Her wrist is already cured like that. This is the power of the subconscious mind. I already told you, all there is is energy. Our body can morph like that through the subconscious mind. It's exactly what we're doing. I've helped people grow inches taller over months. This is the power that has been kept from the masses that we all deserve to understand. I'm not saying, uh, I'm not saying use it to destroy the world. I'm not saying use it to cover up your insecurities, right? All power in the world has an intention and that is our decision. That is our free will to decide how we're going to use this power. But we can use this power like we're already doing to cure diseases all around the world and go places that we've never gone before. This is the subconscious mind.